Hello, my brave immortal soul. Today is a Halloween. <laughs> take two, take two. Three, two, one. Hello, my brave immortal soul. Today is a holiday invented by a little boy to celebrate the spirit of the wolf, dogs, the people who love them, and the people who are kind to them. It's called Wolf Newt Day. So, happy Wolf Newt Day, everybody. Awoo! The idea behind this invented holiday is that the spirit of the wolf brings and hides small gifts around the house for everyone. People who have, have had, or are kind to dogs get better gifts than anyone else. You can eat roasted meat because wolves eat meat and cake decorated like a full moon. Hashtag Wolf Newt. After learning about this holiday, I thought, let's celebrate by making a small gift to give to the dog lovers in our lives. But wait, you'll have to solve my riddles to reveal the ingredients needed for this little gift. So let's play. Riddle me this. What did the cactus say to the other plant? <laughs> hmm. Ding, 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 ding. Ar, 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 ar. Riddle number two. She is a character from a cartoon strip dated back to 1919. She was the love interest of a sailor that loves to eat spinach. Who is she? Ar, ar, ar. I don't know. Sounds like a ghost pup. Ar, 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 ar. <laughs> Riddle number three. I am a plastic container used for dispensing a fluid powered by a hand exerting pressure on its walls. You'll usually find me at barbecues. What am I? Arf, 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 Riddle number four, what did the quantifying device say to the water? Mm. <laughs> oh, riddle number five, I am made from natural ingredients like olive, almond, or coconut oil, and named after a city in Spain that first produced me. I'm safe to use for washing laundry and other things. What could I be? Hmm. Riddle number six. Why did the dolphin cross the ocean? All right, everybody, let's get right to it. We want to make these little presents and distribute them as soon as possible. In the first riddle, what did the cactus say to the other plant? Allo you vera much. <laughs> Allo vera. We'll need one teaspoon of aloe vera gel. And in riddle number two, she's a character from a cartoon strip dating back to 1919. She was the love interest of a sailor that loved eating spinach. Who is she? Olive oil. We'll need one teaspoon of olive oil. In riddle number three, I'm a plastic container used for dispensing a fluid powered by a hand exerting pressure on the walls. You usually find me at barbecues, usually there for ketchup and mustard. What is it? A squeeze bottle. We'll need a squeeze bottle. You can find them in the dollar store. Riddle number four, what did the quantifying device say to the water? I've had it up to here with you. <laughs> What is a quantifying device? A measuring cup. The measuring cup had it up to here. <laughs> In riddle number five, I made from the natural ingredients like olive, almond, or coconut oil, and named after a city in Spain that first produced me. I'm safe to use for washing laundry and other things. What could I be? Castile soap. City of Castile, Spain. It's Castile soap. You can also find those in a dollar store. Riddle number six. Why did the dolphin cross the ocean? To get to the other tide. Hee <laughs> hee. What is a tide? Water. So we'll need two cups of water for this recipe. So Venus, you may ponder, what does this make? It is a DIY doggy shampoo. Now here's how we put it together. Put the water into a squeeze bottle. 
Add two teaspoons of Castile soap to the water. Add the aloe vera gel and olive oil to the bottle. Shake it up really good to mix the ingredients together very well. You can add stickers, ribbons, perhaps a note to remind this doggy shampoo must be shaken up to ensure the ingredients are well combined before using it to wash your beloved pet. And for best results, only bathe your canine once a month so we don't remove all of their body oils um, that protect them as they live their doggy lives. I love this for a little gift, for a stocking stuffer, or to wrap it up and go visiting people who have dogs. However you choose to deliver your gift or use it for your own beloved doggo, happy Wolf Day, everybody!